Hi, Fee Jamison Follen, the Lifestyle Aligner, helping you live the life you love. And to that end, are you lacking motivation? Are you lacking the oomph to follow through with what it is that you really know that you, you even might feel like you want to do it, but there's something there, there's something blocking you. Well, there's quite a useful blog that you might want to have a look, little look at in the written version of this video. And I'm just going to go through some of the things that um, it mentions here, which are a good synopsis for us. So it might be boredom, you might be stressed, you might be burnt out. Um, I've never had boredom, but I've certainly um, experienced a bit of burnout. Thank heavens that got nipped in the bud. Feeling overwhelmed, that can be a cracker for me. It's like, oh, freeze. Um, and a lack of clear goals. You know, you've heard me mention um, before, you may well have done, our heart will not reach for the hand, our, our hand will not reach for what our heart does not yearn for. In other words, we've got to really want something for us to actually move our butt or our hand. And this can mean that we kind of drift about, not really um, getting stuck in. And so, you know, the obvious counter to that would be setting clear goals um, that are achievable. Really, self care, that's one of the most important things, I think, in so many. Um, aspects of life for many of us. I don't know if there's anybody who's immune from that. Changing our environment, you know, stepping outside, changing it up. I'm going to be doing that very shortly after I've done this. It's a bit cool, so I need to make sure I've got warmer gear on as we get later in autumn here um, in New Zealand. In fact, at the time that you get this will be, <laughs> so the time of recording, it's late autumn. By the time you hear this, it will be spring, which is very exciting. Um, and Sometimes it's actually underlying mental imbalance. So in terms of when it comes to our health, that may be out of balance mentally. Um, and that can be, that can be a, a behind, you know, if it's been a chronic situation, oh God, what's going on? And it might well be worth um, talking to a um, qualified practitioner and just, you know, it might just be that it's a little low or it might be something that needs to be attended to um, further. So, um, it, you know, it's not necessarily just that it's um, being <laughs> being really lazy. And it's, I see that it rarely is. It's more about not necessarily having those goals that are really defined and, and kind of like, yeah, I really want this. And it's certainly been true for me. I, I know that changing up the environment, not pushing myself too hard. You know, it, 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 in terms of the results that we ex experience in our lives, it's often about balance. Um, all one of one. I remember uh, when I was studying for my A-levels in the UK and needed to get the right grade so I could go to dental school. Obviously, I didn't end up, I got the grades, but I didn't end up going and I was really pushing myself and studying all hours. And I remember um, a friend of my landlady saying, all work and no play makes thee a dull girl. How true those words are, even today. So what are your thoughts on this? Is it something that you've experienced not being motivated? Is this something that helped you to move through that? Um, always good to hear from you and I will see you on this week's Align with Fee channel for now.